Hi, and welcome to this flow paper tutorial about publishing your magazine using the Zoom Snap feature to improve accessibility. In today's tutorial, we are going to go over how Zoom Snap affects your publication and how your magazine will look after being published with the Zoom Snap feature. Let's begin by opening up a PDF, then heading to the magazine slash ezine category, then the Zoom Snap Reader template. Publishing a PDF to a mobile device often involves a lot of pinching and zooming for the reader. What Flowpaper does is automatically detect the reading order of the paragraphs inside your publication. What this means is that when you open a PDF like this one in Flowpaper, each column in the publication becomes active and you can click on them to automatically zoom in, which means your reader can read without having to pinch and zoom. And when they are ready to move on to the next column, they can simply click on the button at the bottom of the publication to automatically move on. When the page is finished, it will zoom back out so that your reader can select the next page they want to zoom in on. Now you can publish and take a look at how it actually works on a mobile device. Once your publication is finished uploading, you can grab the URL here to test it out. Okay, here is the publication. And if I select the first column here, I zoom right in automatically without having to pinch and zoom. Now I can easily read the text and navigate to the next text block, which is a much nicer reading experience for your users. This particular reading mode is especially helpful for magazines, where you have lots of columns and graphics which can make it harder to zoom in to text. Thank you for watching this flow paper tutorial on publishing your magazine using the Zoom Snap feature to improve accessibility. You can find more tutorials to help you through this process online.